the cage. This fight is scheduled for three rounds of MMA combat. Christian Barrett in the gray tights and Josh Green in the black tights, black and white. In the red corner, heading out of Pickens, fighting out of Goons Academy, standing 5-5. Please welcome to our cage, Christian Barrett. And in the blue corner, heading out of Fayetteville, North Carolina, fighting out of Strike Force MMA. Please welcome to our cage, Josh Green. The referee for this fight, Blake Grice. And here we go. Let's go and lock these guys in the cage and get a fight. These guys at 125 usually have some pretty good slobber knockers going on, don't they, Adrian? Oh, yeah. I expect a very, very high-paced fight full of a lot of action. Shake hands. Christian coming out swinging hard. Josh on his little game, ready to throw back. Nice shot body shot body. by Josh. Blocked by Christian. Christian, nice jab. Nice two to the face. Nice jab. Christian took a shot low. Let the leg kick kind of went across his whole body, more or less, not a direct shot. Exactly what I was about to say. Incidental on that one. It was yeah, not direct. All right, time in. Hey, shake hands. Two. Christian Barrett seems to be stalking Josh right now, keeping Josh on the outside. Body Josh kick. has been going to the body left and right, whether it be to kicks or hands. Stay with it, Dre. Ooh. Head into the mat. Dead into the mat. Josh maintaining a very, very good stance, defending the defending the little Uchimata throw. Very surprising since uh, looks like Christian Barrett has a little wrestling pedigree with his uh, USA wrestling tattoo on his back. Just a little bit, sir. It's real. <laughs> I always want to give you one of those little tattoos, Matt, but I'm a little dark skinned, so what do you think about that? Ah. Uh. I can maybe handle one or two of them. Wouldn't, wouldn't show up well on me. Josh swung for the fences now with a jab and overhand left. You might think about keeping that tongue in his mouth. Nice body shot by Chris. Nice head shot by Chris. Once again to the body by Josh. Josh goes to that left. He's throwing that left hard to the body. Another low shot right now. Not intentional, look like he's trying to go across the leg again. More more foot than direct. And they're good. <laughs> Josh caught him with a good left. Ten second clagger. Nice shot by Christian. Nice right. Nice right. I think that one caught him right in the ear. Oh, he was setting up the uh, Peruvian necktie. I couldn't get it out of my mouth just now, Matt. At least so, one of us can talk tonight. So who, who, who do you think took the first round, Matt? That's going to be a tough one, buddy. That's going to be a tough one. There was a lot of good shots landed. 
Both sides. Yeah. Both sides. Both sides. That's going to be a tough one to call. I'm I glad agree. I'm not a judge tonight. Exactly. I'm glad it's announced. I'm not trying to judge. I think all in all, I think Christian took more clean shots. Josh was killing the body with kicks and punches. Uh, I didn't keep up with the numbers on those, so. Yeah. I, I don't exactly. know. Exactly. It was bunches. It was punches and bunches. Round number two. One thing about the smaller guys is when they come out the second round, they come out like they came out in the first round. Throwing bombs. Christian working the jab again. Josh is throwing the heck out of his two right now. And that two landed on the shoulder though. Yeah. Nice body, body, shot, shot. body shot. Oh. That's where Josh needs to be. When he lands that body shot, he needs to come over top with a right. Look for Christian, though. He keeps his hands pretty high. Oh, Josh froze a little bit. Christian's midsection and right arm are looking very red right now from where he's catching all these kicks and punches. Oh, yeah. On his right side? Yes, sir. Looks like Christian's either catching his breath and trying to uh, work a perfect shot. Oh, just like that. One, two, landed pretty clean. Josh is throwing with bad intentions, but he's dropping his head a good bit. Yeah, Josh Green is definitely throwing all the shots with bad intentions. Christian seemed to be a guy who's picking it. Oh, he's going for the Peruvian necktie. Can it? He needs to get his left leg over higher. All right, so now we get to see a little ground game from the 125-pounders. Josh trying to work a hammer fist. Christian is spinning out very well. Ooh, he ate a bad hammer fist right there. I can't really tell what Christian's working from the bottom right now. It's almost like he had a, a low Kimura on the bottom because Josh was guarding the arm pretty well. Right now, it would be pretty cool if Josh went for a north-south choke. That was a pretty slick to stay. Right with his left arm, it would be very easy to get in. Right now. For videoing, touch your flash off, please. The people in the bar area are using the flash. Please Lead please to the body the from the bottom. Off. Christian is throwing knees to the back a little there. I think he needs to worry more about trying to get up and recompose his guard. He's, he's controlling his arm very well from the bottom right now. Yeah, I think Chris has just got comfortable holding that arm, feeling like he's not in danger. So, you know, figure why move right now. He was working the knees from the bottom very well, too. Yeah. Out. The only problem is with that is now in the judge's eyes, he didn't take any damage. He did pretty well there. It makes it questionable in the judge's eyes. Who won that round? Both fought very, very great in that round. But I have to go with Josh on the second round.
Ooh, nice two, three from Chris. Oh. Fake the shot, made Josh drop down to his knees. Went for the sprawl and there was Looking nothing there. <coughs> Christian was working the front headlock. Josh worked around and pulled guard. Looked like he might have been trying to work the gator roll there, wasn't it? Yeah. For Anaconda took. Josh had Oma Plata. Christian jumped over. Right now, if I was Christian, I'd take my knees and squeeze together and pressure on uh, Josh's head. Right now, he puts his knee on his face. It's not illegal. As long as he doesn't use it as a strike. We're sitting in the middle of a grappling chess match right now. Yeah. <coughs> Almost like Josh was trying to set up a leg saddle. So he go for heel hooks. Got him out. Chris is in mount. Raining down Josh punches. pulls him back down. He's Josh gives him the back up. Christian locks in the rear naked choke. But he does not have but one nope. hook in. And uh -huh. Josh able to slide out. Stuff like that makes me envy these smaller guys. You know, when you see guys like 265 and heavyweight, we're not sliding out of not <laughs> rear naked chokes that easy. These guys are very wiry and very fast. Christian back on top, working that flipper, trying to slide it out, baseball slide out to get into side control. Side control, straighten them out. Right now, Josh has that arm on the back side right now, so Chris is not going to be able to do a lot of damage from here. It's going to be a little weird setup right here. He does have a trap well, though. Yeah, Chris is not going to be able to do any any damage, and Josh is probably not really going to be able to get up that easy. He's got it free, and he's raining down the left. Ten seconds left in the round. Looks like we're going to end this with Christian on top, and Josh defending. Time. And we have a ball game, folks. Great sportsmanship for Crispin, helping his opponent up. These guys definitely did leave it all in the cage tonight. Oh, yeah. Great fight. I think Crispin's going to pull this one on decision, unanimous. He definitely on. took the first and third round. Agreed 100% on that one. Definitely thinking that Christian took the fight. And then again, maybe not. We have a decision of our judges this time. It is unanimous. Your winner, by decision of the judges, from Pickens, Christian. Bell. 